welcome to our programming channel today we will see required field validator in asp.net for that for that first we add new item web form First we take one table rows 3 and columns 2 Just type first name First name, last name Take one text box, then another text box. ID of first text box txt if name txt if name ID of second text box txt l name then then we need one button id of button btn submit then text submit now now we take required field validator control First, we give the error message which we want to show. Four color red. Then set the control to validate property we can see text boxes here we have to select the text box select txt if name we have to double click submit button for click event If we see in browser,
if we click on submit button. We get this error. Web forms an obstruct validation mode requires a script resource mapping for jQuery. Please add a script resource mapping named jQuery case sensitive. To remove this error, we have to make some changes in webconfig file. Below system.web here app settings add key validation settings and copy copy this unobstructed validation mode value none value is equal to none Now if we see Now if we click on submit button Now we can see the error message because of required field validator control first name required if we give here then message disappears we can copy this control and paste here In design we can see ID is different here only we have to change error message last name required and control to validate L name save this If we click on submit button, first name required, last name required. Now if we give first name, then only this error message show. And if we give last name, then there is no error message if first name empty first name required in this way if xbox remains empty at that time required field validator shows error message and if text box is not empty at that time there is no error message so that's all for required 
field validator control in ASP.NET. Thanks for watching.